I see the community damaged. Um, I see a lot of hurt. I see a lot of pain. I see a lot of stress, anxiety, anger. We knew that we had a huge foreclosure crisis here in the state. You know, what was the situation in 2008, 9, 10, 11? Now here we are in 2014. What's happened since then? In places like North Minneapolis and in the east side of St. Paul and certain neighborhoods, the concentration of foreclosures was so high. Wealth was lost. The infrastructure was lost. Uh, you know, we had many properties that have had to be demolished. A lot of um, value into the neighborhood where if, if I was to live in a block of three vacant houses and I bought my home in this amount of value, it, it's not worth that much anymore. One place that we were really interested in looking at was what was happening in what we call the exurbs. In those kinds of places we found that um, mostly there's been a little bit of recovery since the worst of the, uh, the collapse, um, but folks in those areas have to pay a whole lot for um, commuting. Federal investment is really our, um, probably our best way of getting where we need to go. We are calling for, as a coalition, $100 million in bonding. If it were funded, we'd be able to make sure that we can build and rehabilitate housing for people who are homeless.